Junior, here is your watermelon. But remember not to swallow the seeds because it will grow in your body. By the end of this video, you will learn how to make an animated cartoon movie using AI, especially with ChatGPT, and you will be able to maintain consistency throughout your story. All you need is a great idea and a single prompt that will be given to ChatGPT to generate an amazing script and images for you and maintaining consistency throughout the story. So the first thing you need is an idea. Go to ChatGPT and type in your idea. And this is what I said. You can screenshot this prompt if you want, or the best thing for you is to save this video so that you can be able to come back to this prompt, all right? So my idea looks like this. I want to create a very funny AI cartoon movie called Watermelon. The name of the major character in the movie is Junior. The story is about a boy of age 8 to 10. His mom gave him a watermelon and asked him to eat it but not swallow the seeds. Junior ate both the watermelon and the seeds. The next morning when he woke up from sleep, trees began to grow from his nose, ears and head. The entire movie shows him running away from people to hide it and from his mom. I want this movie to be filled with soundtrack. The, the only voice in the movie was when his mom called him and told him to eat the watermelon and not to swallow the seeds. Other scenes are action-packed, fast-paced with sound effects. Give me 20 different test prompts. Notes. One scene is 5 to 10 seconds long when these images will be converted to a video clip. So this is my idea and I gave it to ChatGPT. All right. And see what ChatGPT gave me. ChatGPT gave me the test prompts to be able to generate the images of every particular scene in the movie. So then I asked ChatGPT to give me a cartoon image of the 3D Pixar style of the mother in a PNG format 16 to 9 spec ratio and I got this image of the mother in a PNG format and 16 to 9 aspect ratio. I got this image from Pin Interest and I asked ChatGPT to regenerate it in PNG format 16 to 9 aspect ratio. I, I got this result. So this is the result of what ChatGPT gave me in a PNG format and this is the result of the main character. ChatGPT keeps a mental image of the images it has generated before and ChatGPT is the only AI tool that maintains consistency by adding more information to it. So unlike, unlike any other AI image generators, ChatGPT will be able to take one image, put it in multiple backgrounds, change the, the outfit of that image and still maintain consistency throughout. I went back to all the test prompts that ChatGPT has provided for me. So when you copy the test prompt it provides, you ask it to create an image of the test prompt it has already provided. So I copied the first scene and I asked ChatGPT to generate the first scene. Then I'll copy the second scene and I asked ChatGPT to generate the second scene. Okay, this is the second scene. This is the test prompt that ChatGPT gave me. So close up of Junior swallowing watermelon seed with a cheeky green. Pretending nothing happened, okay? 
This is it. Close up of Junior swallowing watermelon seed with a cheeky grin pretending nothing happened. So copy the test prompt and ask Chachi PT to generate the image of all these prompts it has provided. This will be done after you have gotten the original image of the characters that you want to use in your movie. So for me, it was the mother and junior. So this is all the images that I have gotten. So after you have gotten your image, all you have to do to download it is to click on the image and you click on download to save on your system. You can as well download it by clicking here. It will still be the same. If you remember in the beginning of the video, I used a similar format. I got my ideas from Pinterest. So I went to Pinterest and I downloaded this image. And I also downloaded this image from Pinterest as well. It's a very common image for Disney, you know, movies. So I downloaded this image as well. So after I downloaded the images, I came over to ChatGPT to create an amazing result. So I uploaded the first image and I said to ChatGPT, use this image as a reference, replace Walt Disney pictures and add, and add you see when pictures use the same format as well. And ChatGPT did exactly the same thing. I forgot to add, um, to put it on 16 to 9 format. So I asked, I also asked ChatGPT to regenerate it to 16 to 9 and i got the exact result of what i was looking for this is amazing so after that i also uploaded the second image that i got from pinterest and i asked chachipit to use this one and remove the test and add watermelon to it okay then ChatGPT gave me this result very beautiful and also i uploaded another image that i got from pinterest and then ask ChatGPT to regenerate this and make it 16 to 9. And ChatGPT gave me the result of what I was looking for. And ChatGPT also added um, a watermark. So what I did was I said to ChatGPT, this is beautiful, but can you remove this test and add UC Gwen pictures? And ChatGPT now gave me this result which I was also very impressed with. So the next step is for us to get our soundtrack. For us to do this, we are going to use CapCut to generate our soundtracks. And just open your CapCut, go to audio, click on audio and type in cartoon. After typing in cartoon, click on enter on your keyboard and then you see multiple soundtracks. All right, just click on them to play them. So I'll click on one. So once you're done selecting the soundtrack that you wish to use, the next thing is for you to favorite them like I did here. Just click on the stars, scroll down and click here to put them on favorite. All right. So you can use them later because we are going to use CapCut to edit the video. So now we have gotten our images. The next thing is to convert those images to video. So go to Google and type in Hello AI. So Hello AI is a free AI video generator. It has paid version, but it gives you 100 free credits every single day. The good part about Hello AI is that after using your credit for that a particular day, you can sign out by clicking on your account and log in with another email address and they will give you another 100 free credit. So once you're here in the dashboard, all you have to do is to click on create video. Once you click on create video, click on this to add your image. And we are going to select our image. So I'll click on this one. While it's uploading, you can type in your test prompt. So I'll just type in a simple test prompt. And once you're done, click on this to generate the video. This takes about three minutes for it to finish generating. And while we are waiting, I would like to use this opportunity to tell you that I am giving out 900 free test prompts for your storytelling channel. 
So if you have a faceless channel here on YouTube, or you are planning to start your faceless journey, I am giving out 900 amazing fit test prompts for your storytelling channel, okay? And this test prompt addresses different storytelling topics that you can ask ChatGPT to generate for you. So feel free to grab this test prompt in my video description. So all you have to do, go to my video description and click on free test prompt to assess it. And you have it as a PDF downloaded in your phone or your PC. Also, I would like to ask you to please give me a like if you are finding value in this video so far and do not forget to subscribe if you are new to this channel and of course turn on the post notification and here we have it this is an amazing result this is how you'll be able to generate your videos this is simply an amazing result so these are the steps you need to do take to generate to convert all your images to video so to download it all you have to do is to click on the video and you will see a download icon here so you have to download with watermark if you are using the free plan unfortunately i'll click on download and it will be saved in your system we are also going to use hello ai which is my best AI audio generator too. So to access Hello AI audio, go back to explore and click on audio. This is how the dashboard for Minimas audio looks like. Once you are here, there are so many features they have. They have the text to speech, the voices, the voice isolator. So we are going to use the text to speech. So click on text to speech. Once you are done, you paste in your test here. And once you paste in your test, go to settings and click here where it says voice click there and choose your voice so listen to all these voices and choose the one you want in the quiet of dusk every whispered secret of the city finds its echo in the beating heart of the night here you will see my voice my voice is where you will select the voice that you have generated by yourself minimas audio allows you to clone your own voice basically so i'm going to play it for you to listen to how my voice in ai sounds like hello i'm delighted to assist you with our voice services choose a voice so this is how my voice in ai sounds like and i believe this voice is going to be the best match for genius mother so to to add this voice to the test all you have to do is click on use and then you click on generate junior here is your watermelon but remember not to swallow the seeds because it will grow in your body so this is how it sounds like basically and this is simply amazing so once you are done you download it all right just click on download and it will be saved in your system now you have everything ready you have your voice ready you have your soundtrack ready you have your videos ready the next thing for you to do is to put all of them together. So for us to combine everything together and get our amazing results, we are going to use CapCut and of course it's free and you can use it. So what you have to do is to import all your video clips that you generated for Minimas and what I will do, I will download them. So I'll copy everything open and I'll download every single thing. I will also import the voiceover so first thing i like to do is to add my video clip accordingly so i'm also going to import all the images that i got in the beginning of the video so i'll also add these images based on the type of movie that i created which is more like a story without any voiceover or minimal voiceover and majorly 90% of the entire scene that you saw was filled with soundtrack. I would like to add the soundtrack first so that I will add my clips according to the soundtrack. Okay, so I will go to audio, click on audio, then type in cartoon and select the audio that I prefer. I will align the sound effect first by going to audio and selecting the audios that I have favorited or you can also select them according to what you prefer. So this will be my intro audio and I'll go over to media 
and I'll add the picture. So I would like this to come first. Okay. And I'll click on add, add to it. I can also increase it depending because it's a picture, right? And I will click here and add the second image. So each picture, you can add an animation on each picture. So click on this image, go to animation. Once you go to animation, you select the in or out animation. So I'm going to select the in animation. So I'm going to select the zoom in animation for this particular one. So this editing is going to be largely influenced by your creativity. All right. So I'm going to play this to see how it looks like. The black part is too much. So now the next thing for you to do is to add all your video clips. So the first one that I generated was this, but the first on my scene is this one. So I'll add this one first and I'll add this one first. Okay. Now add this one second and now continue to add them in order. And that is how you create your video. All right, guys, we have come to the end of today's video. If you enjoyed today's tutorial, please do not forget to leave me a like and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to grab your 900 test prompt for your storytelling channel in my video description. It is simply amazing. This test prompt is simply amazing. It gives you 900 storytelling ideas. Okay. 900 storytelling ideas for your faceless channel and click the link in my video description to download your PDF. All right. I will see you in my next video. Thank you for always sticking behind. See you in my next video.